All right, let's make it nighttime. We're going to do a Knight's Cavalry. And then the Falling Star Beast. Perfumer's Grotto, which should be pretty easy. And then the Duo Tree Sentinel. Oh, hand, what am I going to use for this? Oh, but I'll use Bestial Sling again. That was actually pretty decent on the other one. Well, the damage wasn't amazing, but it's quick. I want to try Pest Threads for the Duo Tree Sentinel. Actually, Pest Threads for the Knight's Cavalry could be decent, too. If it tracks well. I know it doesn't track as well as, like, when enemies do it to you, but... I think it'd be okay, still. Where am I going? <laughs> this doesn't look familiar at all. I'll have to check to see if Korn's by the uh, map marker or not. But let's do this first. Actually, you know what? We'll, we'll just we'll take a detour over here. Because he has a new incantation if you get him to Gold Mask. I just don't know if he's here because I have yet to talk to him. Actually, I don't know if he... Where is he normally? He's like around here. I think he's probably still in the round table. It's all right. We get this grace, we'll do the Knight's Cavalry, and we'll do these other bosses, and then we can go talk to him. can't see a thing. Sir? Stop moving. Do a couple of these. Oh my god, that damage is so much better. <laughs> like institutionalized to the uh, damage from Bestial Sling. Catch Flame just like does twice the damage per hit and is probably just as fast. Okay, I didn't think this one through, though, because I don't have anything else for uh, the Falling Star Beast. I think that there's... I don't know if they're super weak to lightning, but, like, I did... Uh, I fought one with Ancient Dragon Lightning Strike, or... I don't know what it is. Spear or Strike, whatever it is. And it, like, almost one-shot it. The one in Kaelid. But we'll just... We'll rock what we have, and it should be okay. Hopefully. Maybe it won't be, I don't know. I think Bestial Sling will do an anything against this guy. I feel like it's going to be garbage. Eh, it's okay. How about Catch Flame? If I could hit him, it'd be good. Dude.
Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Catch Flame is so good. It's so quick. That's what I love about it. And, like, the damage is pretty decent. You know, we don't actually need to do the Tree Sentinel do now. Like, it's... it's yeah. Oh, I'm gonna do it, but... I didn't really need to do it now. Now that I think about it. Because I go back, I get the grace, and then I go back for it. And I can do that at any time. It's not like it's really on line with anything. But it's fine. Wait. Oh my god, it's almost 100k to level already. Actually, what level are we at? Only 124. Sounds high, but like... We normally end around like 180 or something. 180 to 200. This is normally even here. Oh, it's a flower. Oops, wrong button. Burn this thing. All right, I'm going to try pest threads on the trees on tree sentinel. So to Seal Tunnel, we're going to skip. We're going to go to the Merchant Shack, and then we're going to do Lance Axe. I don't think I need to do anything in the outskirts right now. You know what I'm going to do, though? I'm going to go to Corrin. Actually, talk to him. Get him to Altus, and then... I gotta talk to him at the bridge. I gotta I gotta go back to where he first shows up though. Unless he's not here. Which I oh no, he's right here. Oh, welcome to my teach and explore so that one ensuring my way. You do most tarn you, oh well. May the gold D actually does he have anything that I didn't buy that I unaware of? Urgent heal, I never Actually I don't know if I bought Urgent Heal, but I never got rejection, but I don't think I really need it for anything. I can't talk to him, can I? Can we just, like, talk, buddy? Okay. So let's go to his first spot. Actually, you know what? I think maybe I should get Gold Mask first, and then I go there. I, I don't know. Yeah, I'll do I'll do that. I'll talk to Gold Mask first and then I'll go back to Corin. Your channel's pretty bad. Sounds like it's it's probably not a good heal, but it's like it's something if you need it like quickly. Yeah, I I I remember using it, but I didn't think it was that good either. But it's it's quick, I guess. Like the normal heal is not very quick. Alright, 
past threads. Where is it? Here. And... Black Flame would always do well. Do that as like a backup, I guess. Do we have 31 in? Yes. So that's all we need for that. Then we gotta go to like 17 Arcane, I think. That is true. Probably is not worth using. I thought those were gonna miss. It's not that amazing. Maybe it's just not good against this guy. Tracks pretty well, though. Get the other one in here, too. Okay, maybe not. Maybe a bad idea. Okay, pest threads against these guys I don't think is very good. It's probably better against, like, things that aren't armored. I'd imagine. I feel like this isn't going to be very good because I'm just going to end up getting hit a lot. I'm going to try this. Can you charge it? Oh, you can. Let's try it. Was it nerfed? Oh, it staggers on one hit. Wow, okay. That's pretty cool. Problem is, I gotta probably charge it for it to do that. Dude, this fight is just... So stupid. You just get comboed like that half the time. You get hit, staggered, and then just hit by the other guy immediately. It's one of those duo fights that is, like, very different from the other duo fights. In that... It doesn't work the same, like, they're both just aggressive all the time. Usually, they, they tone the aggressiveness down when one is aggroed on you, and the other one will just kind of stand there, but it's not the case with uh, this one or, like, the Knight's Cavalry. They just don't care. Yeah, I don't know about this. I should have used Golden Dow again, and I forgot. So, good job, me. Right, the projectile blocking. I forgot about that too. I actually don't hate the this one. It's just I don't think it's good for this fight. At least, like, not when you're fighting both of them at the same time. I need, like, faster spells. I need, like, maybe Lightning Spear or something. For this. Lightning Spear has pretty good range, too. Maybe I can do this on a horse. That'd be pretty rough, honestly. They don't get staggered for that long, though. That is very good damage. We're also in the rain, so... Probably helps. Don't do it.
Yeah, that didn't snagger. Heal? I literally hit the button to heal. Are you serious? And I hit the roll button and like... <laughs> oh my god. Why is this game so scuffed, man? Character doesn't heal and then I roll that attack and it doesn't roll. Like... I don't know. Uh, Elden Ring is worse, though, when it comes to that sort of stuff than, like, the other games were. I want to go with the other one, actually. Yeah, you can see I'm dealing less damage now. Oh, I don't have Golden Vale. Maybe I had Golden Vale on before. Hang on. Don't mind me. Dude, stop it! Through the pillar, come on. That's a bad idea. start this one. Oh my god, this is annoying. No matter what you do, like, there's always just one attacking you. I have no time to do anything. No time to throw a spear or whatever. Like, it takes forever to heal, so, like... I'll be healing before one even starts doing an attack, and I'll still get hit. Just don't stop. <laughs> they just do not stop attacking. Kill him. 
Did I already use cold? No. Whatever. I'm using it again. Cast something? Or oh, just go. I got, like I'm holding the button. Uh oh. I was hoping it wasn't gonna reach. Please, damn it. I really wish I had a healing spell. I should reallocate, honestly, because I, I still have five flasks I can use. Don't hit me. Just hold on. Don't do anything. Okay. I'm just. I, I knew I was gonna get roll caught there. I rolled so early. All right. I'm just stop messing around with Radagon's Rings of Light. It's it's so slow, man. It's like depending. It really depends on the RNG for the Tree Sentinel. Sometimes you can get it off, and sometimes you just can't. Let me reallocate. If I had more healing flasks, I would have been able to do it there. I wouldn't have gotten so greedy. I do not need that many for this. At this point, I don't even know why I'm finding them as a duo. I guess just because it's more interesting. I never do this with, like, the Knight's Cavalries, though. Those things are just not fun to fight. Period. These, these, these guys are fun to fight. I can't move. I, yeah, like... I was pretty much dead there. I'm just going to fight them one at a time because I'm, I'm sick of this. I just want to move on. I don't think this guy gets any new attacks at like 50%. I think it's pretty much just the same stuff. Oh, he hits you with his torch. Really?
problem with this guy is the shield. He can reflect, like, anything you do. This honestly is, like, pretty good, except for the fact that you can't do anything for, like, a half a second after you cast it. And he gets out of, like, his stagger animation faster than I can roll whatever he's going to do next. Like, I can't do anything. I'm just T-posing. Stuck T-posing. Now I can roll. So he's lining up to do an attack before I can even react to it. I couldn't roll that. It is nice that it staggers them, though. It, like, takes them out of whatever they're doing. But they go right into another attack. Damn it. This is maybe not the best spot to be in. Yeah, they're easy to fight one at a time, which is why I like doing it two at a time, but that's what it is. I, just, I don't want to spend any more time here. Seath water, okay. Seath water, Seath water. Did I not? Here it is. Oh, you know what? Hang on. Ah, uh, never mind. I was gonna say we could do we could do Corin, but I'm gonna I'm gonna wait. Dude, really? Why is that? Why is that a thing? I it. Whatever. I don't care anymore. Like the uh, the AOEs on those are massive. you wouldn't expect. Okay, what do for this boss? Let's see. Probably something that tracks well because they're kind of shifty. Well, we could we could try Radagon's Rings of Light, honestly. Pretty big. I'm just worried I'm gonna get like staggered out of it. But I don't remember if there's a Stake America here. I feel like there is though. God, I wish I'd flame cleanse me now. Is there a stake here? Yeah, there is. Okay. Wonder if I could just die. You know what? Maybe, maybe that's worth doing. Getting the poison off of me. Although there's poison in the boss room. I just don't want to have to deal with it.
please don't get staggered. Wow, he just went out and missed. Oh, that did not miss, though. That hurt. Yeah, this is very hard to, to cast. It does good when it hits, though. I mean, these guys don't have a lot of health. Stop! Stop! Okay, one's dead. Alright, Magma Worm. I'll probably go back to Ancient Dragon Lightning Strike, or whatever it's called. There's Lightning Spear, Lightning Strike, Lightning Stake. There's too many lightning things. Alright, Annie. Feel better, man. Take it easy. Do pest threads here actually. Pest threads. This will be the backup, and then can try and just rot them too right away. Tired of rotting. Let's do poison mist, which is is it's worse, but you know, I don't know. At least I can say I used it a little bit. Hopefully, I have enough FP for this. I only have three blue flasks. I mean, I think with the poison, we'll be fine. It should take out a decent amount of health. I need to stop. Oh, not stopping. It'd actually be so cool if when he does this, he can just, like, fly off the map. Pest is actually pretty good here. Look at that. Yeah, I think it was the tree sandal armor that just like made it not great versus those guys, but it's really good here. Like it's it's pretty good. I won't say it's like amazing. Not the best thing you could use, I imagine, but pretty good. Okay, I it's. I'm, I'm actually a big fan of this. Look at it. <laughs> I take it back. It's, it's really good. <laughs> uh -oh. oh, it staggered him. Thank God, because I was going to get hit. It didn't. Fifteen, five, ten. That's how much health this thing has. That's more health than like anything in DS3 in, in new game, except for maybe Madeir. I mean, I guess technically if you count all of the uh, Demon Prince Entities like each, like all three of them, they have more than that, but same with Frida, probably. But like we're in Gelmir, and that thing is 15. It's also NG, plus. I kind of forgot about that, so never mind. It's not a fair comparison. Things in this game just have more health, though, because I think you know you can get to a higher level in this game, so it makes sense that enemies would be you know, they'd have more HP at least. I'm gonna try pest threads here too, but it might not be uh, that great. I don't know. I think it'd be okay here. I don't see why it wouldn't. There's like five enemies in this fight, though. 
which is pretty annoying. Also, you get a memory stone from this one. So that's cool. What are we doing after... Elmir? Lance Axe, I think. We got Lance Axe's Glaive. Should be cool. Yeah, maybe I don't even need to rest. Let's just do Pest Threads from here. Oh, it didn't reach. Oh, it did reach. Can I do a Golden Val? Right here. Maybe some Poison Mist, if it can... I, I don't think the Poison Mist is going to reach up there. Do this. Hopefully not hit that guy. It still hits me. Okay, I killed... something. Actually did a ton of damage to her too. I didn't even notice. Right, Pest threads, go. Sweet. Emery Stone. Give it to me. Thank you. Then we got Gelmir here as Grey. So I gotta remember the Death Root in here. Then the other two dungeons with Death Root are. Giant Mountaintop Catacombs has one, and then there's one more, but I can't remember it. Oh, Death Touch Catacombs. Okay, and then we have to do the Mountaintops to be a Mariner in the level 9, and we can do Garank's quest, I guess. Beast Eye Quivers. Right, I gotta get more arcane. So we have all the int we need. We just need to get to like. I I think it's 17 arcane for everything. I guess we'll do past threads on uh, Red Wolf too. Oh, this controller. Don't mess up my jump, please. Thank you. There's a shortcut, like, right above this door you can drop down from. But you have to, like, run... You have to go through the lava in that first section with the first chariot. I should have used this earlier. Goodbye to this thing's health. Yeah, okay, see you. All right, uh, Volcano Cave. I'll probably just do past threads again. <laughs> it's 
So the next incantation... I guess it would be the one from Garank, or we could also go to, um... What's this? The, the Dragon Cathedral and get more... Probably get more dragon stuff, because I think I have, like, two hearts. Yeah. And then the fully grown falling star beast, I think I'm gonna do I don't know. Maybe the ancient dragon's lightning strike. I think would be better. This lightning strike's actually good. The other one sucks. <laughs> it's a shame. The regular one is, is not good. This one's inconsistent, but it, like, consistently does damage, even if it's, like, you hit once, you know? Actually, I want to see if we can do any of the new dragon incantations yet. I went up. Oh, I can, I can also get another point of arcane, so we should be able to do, hopefully, one of the new ones. Let's see. Oh, don't pass time. Arcane. Then do this. Dragon Claw. Haven't been able to do that yet. This is 16. That is 15. Okay. Let's try Dragon Claw out. Not that way. This way. And if this sucks, we'll just do past threads. Yeah, it's doable. It's actually, like, pretty good damage. It's slow, but... It staggers pretty quickly. Three hits. Good old jar cannon. I think on the jar cannon run, I'm probably just gonna like go with the faith build and just get like a bunch of healing spells. I can't do damaging incantations, but healing I think is okay in my book. It's not like I haven't done it on other runs. But yeah, the problem with the jar cannon is gonna be uh like just Reichard. <laughs> not 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 just Reichard, but like it's slow. That's the issue. So you gotta be very patient waiting for openings. Like the Great Bow I thought was kinda tough, but the jar cannon's like twice as bad. Alright, what are we doing for this one? The Ancient Dragon Lightning Strike. Two Golden Bell. Very much like Fort. I never really, really thought about that. That like that attack, a charge, and the and the bull, I guess, from Sekiro. Don't grab me. Just let me do the thing. Oh, kill me, right? Yeah. Did a lot of damage though.
Dude. Should be able to run from that. Yeah, that would have been a good spot for a lightning strike, but I was nowhere near him, unfortunately. Hey, Nero. Yeah, the incantations have been pretty good, honestly. Some of them are a bit, like, not so good, but a lot of them are pretty hard-hitting. How you doing, man? Like, look at that. This thing normally is super tanky, but I, I have a feeling it's weak to lightning. It's based on how much damage this is doing to it. How do I get out of here? All right, one more. Just the uh, ulcerated tree spirit and then lance sax. I'm doing well. messing around with incantations. It's been a lot of fun. All right, more cane. Could do pest threads here, too. I kind of want to try Dragon Claw on this thing. I don't think I hit that directly. Yeah, I think it does a little more damage if you hit it directly. Dude, what is this? Why does it? Why does the fire go right up to it? Let's see how this does. Well, if it hit, it would do better, I'm sure. Uh oh. Three! Yeah, that's more like it. The range on pest threads isn't that great. It's decent, but it's not super but it, it's pretty hard. Oh, nice. Then there's that, which just shreds it. Like, my God. All right, let's say axe. Oh, I didn't get the reward, which I don't think is anything. I think it's just like a 
sacred tier or something. Not a sacred, uh, whatever they are. Thanks for the physic. I can't remember what they're called. Actually, hang on. Ah, never mind. ADLs is better than Pest Threads, but Pest Threads is cheap. Yeah. Like, the, the Ancient Dragon Lightning Spear is just so good against big enemies. I don't know how it's going to be against Lynn Sayx, though. I don't know if she's immune to lightning or resistant, rather, not immune. But I'm going to try it. Infinite FP tier? Oh, really? Yeah, it's okay. I'm not too concerned about that. But, of course it would. <laughs> the one that I leave early. It's just so weird that you have to be like in vicinity of the uh, the boss to get the item. And you don't get it randomly. There's the grace. It's not gone forever. If you go back near there, you can get it. But I'm not. Uh... Too concerned about it. Is a custom well. All right, let me buy this, and then we're gonna go leave. But it happens all the time with the uh, the one putrid avatar in the snowfield. I kill it and then warp away before I can get the item, and then I have to go to Theodorix. And because I'm heading in the direction of the putrid avatar, it just, like, randomly gives me the item when I get closer to the spot where the boss was. I remember once doing, uh, I don't know what I was doing, but I killed the Godskid Apostle over there and warped away quickly, and then, like, I just left this whole area for a while, came back and randomly got, like, the Godskin Peeler and the Incant in the, I think it's like scouring black flame or something. Oh, come on. Hit the thing. Really? Surely they didn't patch it. There we go. Okay, she might be immune to lightning, and I am dead. Not immune, I keep saying immune, resistant. We'll do past threads. Can probably rot or two, actually. Death Lightning? Does that actually do damage? Because I didn't think it did damage, I thought it just did Death Light build up. Because if it does damage, then I'll, I'll get it, but I have to do uh, Fortis Axe's Remembrance. This. Take that off. Take this off. Can do this too. Yeah, I might try it then. I thought it was just, uh. I thought it was just Death Blight build up, which would be useless against, like, anything that's not an NPC. And honestly, I don't even know if it works on the NPCs. Dude, what is going on here? Gonna 
Packers. The Rams. Thank you. Please rot. You rotted? You were not rotted. Can you run her? Oh, I need more. Stop it. The damage on this alone, though, is pretty good. We should definitely run it now. Mortis Axe is going to be a delight. I can already tell. No, don't target the ram. Great enemy felled. Stone sword keys, we have three. Okay. Probably gonna need more of those. One right here. Alright, black knife assassin. What do? I have to do black blade, I think. Hopefully I can do it with what I have left. This is all I have for FP. <laughs> so, we'll see. Is this... Is this... Doesn't cost much. Didn't hit anything, though. I need her to jump or something. Jump. 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 Thank you. Yeah, I don't know about that. I'll try... I don't know if I can kill her, man. I, I don't think I can. I'm gonna be out of FP before I even can get a chance to. I'm gonna go get more FP, I guess. Come back. Or, or, you're right, I forgot. You can't go on a horse near these assassins or they're just going to do that to you and ruin your life. So, that's fine. End result is the same. I was going to be here anyways. Do this, give this a try. Let's do Catch Flame, too. Actually, we'll do O Flame. So, Psychic Fighting Black Knife Assassins. They're, they're very quick. I feel like a lot of the time you're just kind of dodging them. And then they have, like, two punishable attacks. But yeah, they're 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 super annoying if you're on torrent because like in the randomizer, I was constantly just getting knocked off of torrent. They just one shot torrent essentially. I hate cold mail. Wonder why there's a black knife assassin here though. Just in, in, randomly, you know, just in, right in front of this hero's grave. Okay, please do something better. Yeah, it's not that great. Probably better if you hit it directly, though. Yeah, that's definitely better. 745 instead of 300 something.
Oh my god. O Flame is just. The damage is fine, it's just. Like, you cast it wherever you're looking, so half the time you just don't hit. Oh, nice. He spawned. Hit it. Stop. Up in the air. Like, like, look at that. I'm looking slightly to the right, so instead of hitting the assassin, I just shoot to the right. It's so frustrating. DS2 Great Hammers all over again. It's a, <laughs> probably more than just DS2 Great Hammers. DS2 had a lot of that. Charge me. Oh, she dodged. Oh, no, she didn't dodge it. Still got hit. That's some range. That, uh, this glaive. Black Knife. I am the Black Knife Assassin. Okay, after this, we're going to do Orin's quest. At least, just to, mainly just to get, like, one spell. Oh, I should level up. I'm not going to push that yet. I think I'm going to start actually going... Do I want more Vigor now? No, I think I should go... I should go 60 Faith first. I don't need... The arcane yet though, because I think I only need 15 for everything I have currently. Oh, no, that's not true. I need 16. Oh well. This might be the, uh, one of the worst dungeons in the randomizer. Yo, can you... One of the light... Really. Trying to get the glaive off, but I can't... I think it's one of the worst dungeons, period, but it's definitely one of the worst in the randomizer. Because depending on the enemies here, like this room could be a mess. I'm gonna golden bow before I go in that room. Yeah, 
Ah, oh, dude, I was hoping it would kill him. At least you get immunity, or like, you get iframes. We don't get iframes. I always say iframes. You get the uh, sniper armor. If you get in the air, anyway. If, if you get in the air. No, other one, other one. Get the other one. This guy. Can you stop? My god. And I couldn't heal. Alright, Lance takes this leave too slow for this. We need something else. Like you could do it, I just it's it's very slow for for these guys. Let me see, what else do I have? Pass threads also would have been too slow. That's just sling would have worked. But I need something for the boss, too. You do... Dragon Claw is kind of fun, honestly. You know what? Let's do the uh, Tail spell, actually, too. Yeah, the imps uh, in this game are so obnoxious. They just spam them. They took it from DS3, and then they just put, like, ten of them in every dungeon. With bleed, too. Like, that's the, I think, the worst part. Is the bleed. Like, they're annoying, but then it's like they do extra damage. You think you're gonna be fine, and then they bleed you, and then die. Or you die. He's not dead, huh? Is this guy? He, he does not want to go in the light. He walked right up to it, then walked right around it, and then said, nah, I'm good. Can I pick these up? Whoa. What are you doing? Come on. <laughs> what are they doing? Let's wait for his buddy, I guess. This is the guy that makes this part so annoying, though. Did he drop down? Yeah. Okay. And now he's just idling. This is why I hate this dungeon. The main reason, I'd say. Come on. Chase me. Please. Dude, like how? Like, I don't get it, man. Can I make him idle backwards the other way? No, of course not. He just doesn't cooperate half the time. Kick. Thank you. Oh, 
missed. Please hit him. Thank you. Like, I, I just... This guy's just the worst. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, I couldn't... actually hit me that time. Alright, it's fine. Like, he knocked me out of the attack, which he has yet to do. Until there. Alright, well, that's done. I want to try the Crucible Tail here. See if it's any good on this guy. Okay, you can knock him out of his attack, so that's good. To win. Nice stored roll, game. Thanks. Can you knock him out of this, I wonder? No. That would have been cool, though. Just permanently stop him from going into phase two. Oh, dude, what? I disagree. I should be getting hyper armor here, but I am not. Ah, oh, he, he jumped over it. He's. Dude, I, I cannot cast this thing. 